Hi folks, Scott Jones at Mount Comfort RV, Indianapolis, Indiana, just east of the city. Um, as always, if you have any questions about this video or anything you see on our website, uh, trade value, etc., please feel free to give me a call. You can use the toll-free number listed below on the screen, uh, or you can also call me on my personal cell. It's 317-507-8226, and you can call or text to that number. Today, I'm going to take you through a new, very nice 2016 Baystar Sport. This is a floor plan called a 2903. Uh, really, really unique because most people, when they tell you they're showing you a 29-foot motorhome, they're actually quite a bit bigger than that. This motorhome actually measures out under 30 feet. So if you're looking for something that is easy to maneuver, can maybe fit in a tight storage space, etc., this is definitely something you should consider. Uh, the other thing that's unique about it is it's got a complete full wall slide. Um, Technically, this is Newmar's entry-level motorhome, but to be perfectly honest, Newmar doesn't really do anything entry-level. Uh, this just happens to be where they start. So you get the full wall slide out. You get full body paint with really nice graphics. Uh, I think probably one of the best paint jobs in the industry. Newmar does all their own paint uh, at their facility. They don't outsource it to a third-party company. Uh, it is on a Ford chassis, F53 with a Triton V10, has plenty of power, 19 and a half inch wheels all the way around, and I say it is just under 30 feet. As we go down the side of the slide here, uh, you will also notice it has the new frameless windows, uh, and then those open as what's called a jealousy style, so it hinges, and the bottom here opens up. And uh, so you can get cross ventilation through the RV even on a rainy day without worrying about water coming in through the screens. As we come down around the back of the coach, you'll see it's got a nice full molded rear cap, seamless integrated backup camera. It's not mounted on the exterior, it's molded into the cap. Very nice look. Um, recessed tail lights, very attractive. Have that access ladder if you want to get on the roof for, for any maintenance issues. One of the things I always like to point out with Newmar slide outs is this slide actually is flush mount when you close it. And nobody else can say that. With every other manufacturer, this flange sits on the outside of the uh, motorhome and the seal is on the outside. You'll notice here your seal is on the inside of the wall and this flange actually goes in flush. So it's not protruding outside the side of the motorhome. Far less chance of any water or rain getting in uh, and less air noise as you're going down the road. So very unique design, uh, unique to Newmar. As we go inside here, we'll see you got a double electric power step. And we'll start right in the front cockpit here. Uh, one of the first things you'll notice is you have flex still seating. Uh, and Newmar takes it a step further than that in that they use all flex still furniture throughout the RV. So you have very high quality furniture. Notice you've got a very small engine doghouse cover. Uh, not a big step to mess with. Uh, it is all fully carpeted in the front to help with sound insulation. As you go across the dashboard, you'll see you do have an integrated backup camera for helping you park. And over here, you'll see you got power mirrors with the defrosters built in. And you also have a auto level system for your jack. So when you're ready to set up at camp, all you have to do is turn the power button on, hit auto level, the jacks will go down, take a reading and self adjust very quick, very easy. Doesn't take a lot of uh, effort on your part to set up. You'll notice you got a nice flat screen TV already built into the front cabinet here. It is a Vizio. Numar does use all name brand products. One of the things you'll notice in the window here is they now have premium audio from JBL and it is actually sound tuned by JBL engineers to maximize the quality of the sound that you get from the stereo inside this particular motorhome. Another thing I always like to point out with Numar is you have a contact at the factory. In this case, Steve Moser. Uh, you can call him at the factory during business hours or after hours. That number forwards to his cell phone. He is a product specialist for Baystar. So if you have questions, if you have a technical problem, 8 o'clock at night on a Saturday, can't figure out why your slide won't open, you have a friend at the factory that you can actually call and talk to. Nobody else can tell you that. The other customer support numbers that you're going to hear about are through a third-party company called CoachNet. Uh, so if you have another brand of motorhome and they say, oh, we have that too, it's not the same thing. This is unique to Newmar. Um, 
Looking over the entry door here, I always like to point out, they do a good job of putting all your major systems here in one area. So you've got your battery disconnect for your house batteries. You've got your tank readings here for your voltage and your holding tanks. Your water pump to turn on. Power awning, which is electric. Yeah, very easy to open and close. You don't have to go out there with an awning tool and, and mess with having to close the awning up. And especially, you know, if it happens to be raining, you want to close it, you can just stand here and close it. You don't have to go out in the rain and do it. Standard feature from Numar. And then next to that button, you'll see you've got the slide out control mechanism, power step, and then your water heater control. So very simple, nice central location. As with all Numar products, the cabinetry is extraordinarily high quality. They do hand make and stain all their own cabinets. Uh, very nicely done. This unit does have two sink covers. And you'll notice here you've got a single lever faucet. It is mowing. It's not a cheap aftermarket. Underneath the counter uh, mounted sinks, they're stainless steel. Full size residential traps. They don't use the little trailer traps you see in a lot of what other companies call entry level motorhomes. Corian type countertops, which is very nice. The covers are nice because when you're not using the sink and you're ready to make sandwiches for lunch or something, this just makes all extra counter space very usable. Uh, you see, you got a three burner stove with an oven as well as a microwave. And then again, you'll see all your drawers very nicely done. Full extension, so it's easy to get into the entire box. Uh, metal runners. Then we'll switch over to the slide out here. Now, one of the things I mentioned on the outside that makes this coach unique is it is a full wall slide. So this slide actually starts right behind the driver's seat and goes all the way to the very back of the motorhome in the bedroom. So again, under 30 feet long, but feels incredibly spacious in here, like a little mini condo. And it's because of that full wall slide. There's no interruption to it. Here you've got a leather sofa that makes into a sleeping area, as well as a dinette booth that also converts into a sleeping area. And you'll notice you got very high quality materials throughout. Uh, also, if you look underneath the dinette here, you'll see that you don't have the traditional leg or the pedestal post. The leg goes back in an angle, so it's out of the way of your feet. And also you'll notice that this slopes backwards. Uh, that's so when you're sitting there, if you're one of those people that like to pull your feet back, you're not constantly kicking the base of the booth. It's actually angled back so your feet can come back without banging into it. Uh, again, something you don't see on most manufacturers. Um, completing the kitchen there, you'll see you got the two-door refrigerator as well as you've got nice storage above. Um, the one thing I've noticed in this, so many manufacturers mount the refrigerators fairly high and for shorter people they can be tough to get into. Uh, these are the freezer is right at eye level. It's very simple to get access or even if your kids want to get in to get a soda pop or something out, it's easier to get into. Then we have our side bathroom here and notice you've got the Nice big shower with the roll around doors and skylight overhead. Lots of medicine cabinet space. You do have a nice six panel door uh, with nice hardware. Very attractive look, doesn't look cheap. Uh, as we move toward the back here, you'll see there's two cabinets here. This one is a food pantry that is shelved out for your box goods or canned goods. And this one is a hanging wardrobe. It's got the bar in the top and a full length hanging wardrobe there. Now, when we step into the bedroom, one of the things you're gonna notice is you've got a huge area at the foot of the bed here where you can change your clothes after you get up in the morning or after you shower. So many motorhomes and bedrooms are really tight and hard to move around in. The, re the way this happens is because you have a full wall slide on this side of the motorhome, and then they've added a bed slide out on this side. So this is extended both directions, gives you a nice walk around queen bed, nightstands, you got cross windows on the, on the slide out, you got a nice big rear window here, but you have plenty of area to, to, to negotiate. Um, you've also got two additional his and hers wardrobes for additional hanging clothes here. Another Vizio flat screen TV. And then if you look down below, you've got six nice big deep drawers. So you've got lots of place for underwear and socks and blue jeans. So you're not gonna run out of places to store your clothing. Um, it, again, in a motorhome that's less than 30 feet long. Very unique design. Um, nice pocket door here for the bedroom for privacy. So you're not dealing with a cheap curtain or cheap door there. You got a nice lockable door. Um, so again, just to recap, Numar. Highest quality you can buy, 
full body paint, flush wall slide outs, um, really high quality cabinetry, solid wood, very nice. Less than 30 feet long, but a full wall slide, so you've got a ton of space. Again, if you have any questions on this motorhome or anything you see on our website, if you have a trade or you need payment options, uh, please feel free to call me anytime. You can use the toll-free number that you see below me on the screen, uh, or you can also contact me on my cell phone via you can call or text me, 317-507-8226. Thanks for taking some time to watch this video.